Target 12 Investigators exclusive, a CCRI employee who worked for the school for almost three decades, is terminated following an investigation into her travel expenses that were paid for with your tax dollars. Coworkers tell Target 12 they saw her sitting at her desk when she claimed she was traveling. And now we've learned there's a new development. From the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom, Target 12 Investigator Walt Buteau is at the school's Lincoln campus. Your taxes help pay for a CCRI nursing program that helps students from across the state. But Target 12 discovered the now former head of that program may have been paid for places she didn't go. Mary Perillo was the director of CCRI's certified nursing assistant program until December 18th, when documents obtained by Target 12 show she was terminated. We found out through a Freedom of Information Act request that Perillo was the subject of an eight-month CCRI internal investigation. We requested her last three years of travel vouchers that show she was paid almost $9,000 in taxpayer-funded reimbursements. Documents show she became program director in 96 and was making just under $63,000 a year when she was let go. On the travel vouchers, Perillo claimed she drove to several locations, from Woonsocket to Westerly and out to Newport, where CCRI was conducting CNA testing classes and meetings. But we tracked down some of Perillo's co-workers who say they were interviewed for the CCRI investigation, and they tell us she did not attend the programs they attended, and at times they say she was at her desk when she claimed she was somewhere else. We just want your side of the story. Perillo said nothing earlier this week as she entered an arbitration hearing at National Education Association headquarters in Cranston. On a second day, as we tried to ask her some questions again, she shut her car door and the driver took off away from our camera. She later returned and entered silently through the back door. The process of getting information for this Target 12 investigation required a half dozen Freedom of Information requests and an appeal to the Attorney General's office when CCRI refused to tell us the reason Perillo was terminated. We're still waiting on the results of that appeal. CCRI also will not comment on why they did not ask an outside organization to investigate. Instead, as indicated by information obtained from another FOIA request, the college used taxpayer money to hire a part-time adjunct college professor at about $46 an hour for 77 and a half hours of work for a total of just over 3500 of your tax dollars. No one would comment about the purpose of that arbitration hearing other than to say it involved Perillo and her employment here at CCRI. With the Target 12 investigators in Lincoln, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.